Hi guys, hi guys, hi guys. <laughs> hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's another day, another video. And on this vlog, we're just gonna spend the weekend together. That is Saturday and Sunday. And you're gonna be bonding with my family through every activity that we're gonna take part in. Whether it's cooking, going out, uh just basically doing house chores stuff like that it's what we're gonna do in this video i hope you're going to enjoy it as much as i enjoyed filming it and if you do give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below and if you haven't subscribed yet kindly consider subscribing and join our family if you are a returning subscriber thank you thank you thank you so much you know i love you for always coming back to watch another of my videos for my premier gang your family yeah so thank you so much for always supporting my channel i really do appreciate you guys also now this is the part where i say if you haven't subscribed and you don't join my premiers you are missing out anyway thank you i hope you really enjoy this video so at this point it's saturday morning and we're making pancakes with my baby they just closed school yesterday and yeah so you're gonna be seeing a lot of him in my videos because where mama is baby boy is so yeah i hope you enjoyed this vlog if you want the recipe for the pancakes i have it separately in this channel somewhere down below so i will link it up up here so that you can see because i will not be explaining also i want to apologize for this pan i don't know why i feel the need to apologize because i really need to buy a pan but it does fine for us for now i know i know it's the old is gold kind of vibe here but i'm gonna buy another one yeah soon maybe in the next vlog i won't be using this one but for now Please enjoy with me. I start to sail along these ocean waves. Nobody knows, nobody knows how to find us. It's turning out to be a perfect day. I just want to leave our normal lives behind us. So let's get lost out here. No one else out here. Find ourselves out here. Oh. So at this point my son decided he wanted to do his own designs and he added some <laughs> sprinkles to it so I just let him do it and yeah I hope you're still enjoying the vlog so far if you are let me know down below what other activities do you do with your children to bond because I think cooking is one of the things we do together mostly so yeah don't forget to give this video a thumbs up leave a comment if you haven't subscribed again kindly consider subscribing so these are our pancakes and yeah they were really yummy that one was supposed to be mickey mouse i guess anyway yeah so let's continue the vlog honestly sato i don't think i did anything significant during the day i think i just bonded with the kids and just chilled out and then in the evening i just decided uh let me clean out hubby's closet okay not clean out like organize it just a tiny bit he actually usually 
preserve it for quite a while like he doesn't disorganize his clothes actually as much as i disorganize my own so i have it has been a while since i had to like you know so yeah today was also laundry day so most of his clothes are outside and i didn't want them to come and find the closet looking like this so i decided to just take out all the clothes fold them and then organize them as we wait for the other ones to dry so that once the others are ready we just come and put them like in the correct way so yeah this is what we're doing now i hope you are still with me started out by sorting out the socks this is where i put my socks in the red car basket i know i need to upgrade my organization skills <laughs> so i was sorting out the socks the ones that are paired the ones that are not paired and i was finding it hard to find some of the socks i don't know where they are and i was also finding my son's socks here it is just a mess but if i lay down and i play dead and i stay dead maybe you'll get sick of being the monster Never really know just what you want With you I don't ever feel calm I can feel the sweat inside my palms Play with me like cats and a string You don't understand the pain it brings You don't ever wanna give me wings You don't ever wanna set me free You know I'm addicted to you And it's twisted you've been gifted with the evil voodoo Got me coming back for more even when I've been screwed Dolls full of pins, pierce my heart straight through Got issues in my head I like you in my bed But you keep me on red Oh, everything is like a test I better not text or I'll come off desperate But if I lay down and I play dead And I stay dead Maybe you'll get sick of being the monster Out of my head, under my bed Think you're something out of my head Always sorry, the conclusion. Even though I offer all of the solutions, I wish you loved me like I love you. It's stupid. When I'm alone with you, I never feel lucid. I wish I wasn't struck by Cupid. I wish when I first saw you, I knew this. When I'm with you, I feel so useless. I feel diluted. My heart's been wounded. Silhouettes of you are like. That's how the closet turned out. Yeah, most of his clothes are outside. That is why it seems like that empty. But yeah, I also put uh, my socks like this, like inside each other instead of like the ball nini because it doesn't expand the top. That is why I put them like that. Anyway, that is how it is. Later on, I went to make a uh, dinner. So our house help helped me prepare some of the ingredients, you know, like cut the onions, the potatoes, nini nini. And then I just walked in and I began cooking dinner. So for dinner that day we were having uh, mukimo and some liver. And my liver, let me first tell you something about the way I get my liver. When I'm buying liver, I usually ask the butchery person to skin it off. To remove the clear cover of the liver. So that it become easier to cook and it is not tough for my kids to eat. Yeah, so that is a tip. I don't know even where I got it from, but yeah. And then I have to boil them first because of the tapeworms and everything. And then later on, uh, we are going to fry. As for my mokimo, I usually use dried uh, stinging nettle leaves. Zinaito are the fai in my language, so I don't know what other people call them, but we call them the fai. So I use the dried version. I don't use the fresh ones, but sometimes I use fresh, but mostly we use the dried version. And so I boil the potatoes and then put my githeri, then put the 
powdered veggies on the top and then I I mash the I mash the mukimo and then on the side in a pan I usually like fry onions and then I add a little salt and some oil like good amount of oil into the onions that is what I'm going to pour into my mukimo and then I am going to like mix it in this gives it a fried kind of taste it is really yummy if you have never tried this please try it some oil and go ahead to fry my uh, liver so the only ingredients i'm gonna use for the liver is onions uh, some tomatoes some green pepper then i'm gonna spice it up a little bit just to get that um you know how liver has this distinct like is it a smell or a taste something so i like it a bit flavored yeah so that is what we're doing here also, I put my liver directly into the onion before I put my tomatoes and my pepper because they were boiled. They have to get fried first in the oil so that they can taste fried and not boiled. So that is why I start with the liver first before I put uh, the veggies. Once you start with the tomatoes and the pepper, the liver does not get over the boiled taste. So yeah. We are going to fry, we are going to add all our, all our spices. I'm going to list them down below if you care to know. Or maybe, yeah. The alarm goes off and she gets up to watch the morning news. Doesn't work no more but tells a lot of stories about her youth. Drinks more lately and got pills in many different colors too. Morning light is showing she moves the chair to look out at her view. But a shop was built right across the street And it stands by the sunrise used to be In the afternoon from the couch to read Those through old pictures and memories Our heroes have been forgotten Our heroes so brave and bold Our heroes have been forgotten Our heroes so they got old Our heroes have been forgotten So as for the side, I made some kachumbari or guacamole, if you can say it. So in this video, I want to tag Lan with Flo. Yeah, I want to give a, a shout out to a fellow YouTuber. Her name is Lan with Flo. She has amazing content. And the reason I'm doing that is because in her previous video, she was talking about avocado costing her 40 shillings. And I told her in my place... The most expensive avocado is 20 shillings and this is the avocado for 20 shillings. It's big, it's yummy and it's amazing. Anyway, go check out her channel and tell her you came from me. Yeah, so say hi to her, subscribe, watch her content and make sure you give her my regards. Learn with flow. <laughs> Early the next morning. So it's Sunday morning and again we're in the kitchen with my son. It's our favorite place to be, I guess. <laughs> anyway, today we'll be making some eggs. And again, 
the channel of learn with flow is gonna get another shout out because she has this amazing video in her channel where she does different kinds of egg recipes you can make for breakfast and you guys should watch it because it's amazing and you will never have eggs the same way again so this is just adding to what she gave us she gave us four recipes so this one is number five <laughs> yeah so once you go to her channel check her out watch that video and you're gonna love your eggs oh my god learn with flow we are always learning in her channel anyway say hi to her guys i know you're gonna do me a great great deal go to her channel just say hi to her thank you anyway today we're making eggs and we are gonna be baking our eggs and we're gonna be doing with a cocktail of uh that's a pellet pellet is like another form of meat bite um, I don't even know what I can say and then we're gonna be using some bronze so you cut them up into small cubicles or small sizes and then we're gonna add uh, tomato and green pepper and onion to the to eat and then we're gonna be baking anyway just stick around and you're gonna see all of it in the video it is self-explanatory i hope you're still enjoying the video and you're still gonna stay with me to the end because we are also going out as a family and i want you to enjoy with us walking away your words are lost on me It's taking everything Not to turn around Throw it away See if you'll let go of me When you're not holding me I can see it now Hey, when I lose But if I'm gonna lose you I'm like, oh shit, I've been doing this a long time Lost in my head, I don't care, I'm not gonna lose it I'm not gonna lose this I'm up all day, all night, we playing our last fight Now in hindsight, I don't care, I'm not gonna lose it I'm not gonna lose this Yeah, kinda hate myself sometimes Everything was on the line Didn't wanna be the one who had to say it No, I can't rewind the time Promise I'll put down my pride Don't look back because I mean it when I say it So guys i need uh i need a tip on how to what do we call this like my baking tray got a bit i don't know whether it's rust or it is discoloration i don't know what it is but i have tried washing it with every trick every hack nothing seems to work so if you know how to get rid of that uh like burnt you know uh look of the tray please 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 let me know in the comment section down below and yeah so this is us so what you basically do is you oil your baking tray you put some oil in each uh section and then you add your eggs and then on each egg we are going to fill it up with our fillings whichever order you want to prefer this is just our preference we did not like you know it's not like you have to do it exactly like we did you can put anything and it's gonna turn out great and amazing so you tailor it to your own taste 
wish I could get through to you Don't know what I'd do to ya Anything I say will come off as wrong and you're not alone Something feels out of place but you have no tell It's like we want the same things but the lines we've drawn are too parallel I can't sleep when you're not talking to me Got me suffering in silence, can't breathe when you're not So at this point you can bake it like this but then we had some cheese some cinnamon mozzarella cheese this is like the most amazing cheese in the market I trust me so we decided to add it to our eggs and yeah now 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 <laughs> I am laughing because I need to give you a heads up of what I did. You see that grater that my son is holding? It couldn't work on this uh, cheese. I couldn't grate using it like the cheese was too soft for it. So instead of grating it, I ended up like cutting it using a knife because I ain't about just sitting there and trying and wasting time and people are hungry and it's breakfast. So yeah. I need to get a good grit. <laughs> uh, yeah. gonna bake your eggs in the oven for about 15 minutes 15 to 20 minutes at 160 degrees celsius or until the edge is like a brownish and it's starting to come off so yeah this is the end product it was the yummiest thing you can add spices if you love spiced eggs but i felt like the paper was enough for my babies so yeah a few hours later so since it was on a Sunday, we decided to take the kids out uh, for them to just have some fun. Basically, we usually do family fun days on Sundays. So that is where you take we take the kids out to eat out and then play as much as possible. So this is the venue where we were going on this particular Sunday. And we had so much fun because there's so much space. Well, there are not a lot of like... Um, game activities for the kids to play but instead there is usually a stand where they sell um what do i say they sell toys and balloons and balls and so in the cost that you would have paid for a bouncing castle instead you come and buy a toy for your child and your child can go home with the toy afterwards so yeah so basically the parents just sit in the tents behind there and the kids can use the field to run around and make new friends and everything so yeah this is me and my boys and we are going to the table to check what we can pick up and what we can buy for the day and yeah basically i hope you are still enjoying this vlog <laughs> i know it is basic but I really do hope you're enjoying it. Anyway, yeah.
so as the kids are having fun in the field uh, me and hubby catch up and play some cards as well as we bond and it's usually so much fun and relaxing and yeah so our house help was kind enough to, to, to join us today so she was uh, with the kids so it gave us a bit more time a bit more personal time normally on other Sundays she goes on her own business and we have to handle the kids on our own and be able to balance but it's always fun uh, either way so this is a lunch uh, okay yeah this is our lunch of the day basically my son got the first serving and then we had to wait for our turn which was getting ready yeah he got hungrier before us and we wanted to have something different but eventually we ended up having the same thing all of us like except for the complimentary food yeah for him he had fries and for us we had ugali and since we were really really hungry i forgot to take a photo for you guys so you just have to do with what i'm doing right now This is my entire family for those who are new to the channel. As we have grown, actually, we are 1600 subscribers as we speak, and I feel so blessed. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, guys. And may we continue to grow. So, until next time, thank you for watching. Stay safe, and I'll see you in my next video. <laughs> thank you for watching.